Right, so anyway, you can buy these at CVS. They're about 26 bucks. It's an antigen self-test for infectious detection by Abbott. If you notice up here, it says the product has not been FDA cleared or approved, but has been authorized by the FDA and the EUA. So I don't know. Hmm. It's for detection of SARS, COVID-2, COVID-19. Now, if you, you can get false positives and you can get a false negative. So if you get a negative, you better not have a, a false confidence. <laughs> so you might still have to, you know, go to a doctor and see what the heck's up. But anyway, this may make you feel better. It comes with uh, two test cards, two nasal swabs, and two reagent bottles. And uh, we're gonna show you how, to, how this works right now. This is what it looks like on the front. This is the front of it. The Abbott Benax Now 2-Test COVID-19 Antigen Self-Test for Infectious Detection. It's easy, simple nasal swabs. It's fast, results in 15 minutes. And as I said, you know, you could get false positives and you can get a false negative. So th this isn't the end all. I think the PCR test is probably the best way to go. But that takes like three or four days to get the get the thing back, which is ridiculous. Especially if you want to go get the uh, the uh, Regeneron uh, monoclonal antibodies. So if you do this and you're positive, you, you know they can't deny you. I don't think. I could be wrong on that. Don't quote me. All right, let's try it out. All right. So anyway, we've already done one of the tests, so we're gonna do the second one. And. Um, comes with a bunch of stuff. Anyway, you get your swab right here. Let's put that there. This is the reagent that you need to use. And your hermetically sealed card is in here. And we're going to show you how this works. It's really simple, actually. It's pretty easy to do. All right, so these are the three things you get. You got your swab. And I've kind of opened this area here so it'll be easier to pull apart. You got your card and you get your reagent here. So the first thing you got to do is open up and get your card out of here. And you want to wash your hands before you do this. So I've washed my hands. I'm going to pull the card out. All right, I'm going to flip it over. Whoops. This is the front of the card here. And you can see right there it says control. You see that blue line? Now when I open this, what they say is to bend it like this. Because what you want it to do is sit flat on the surface here. Because what we have to do is put a reagent inside of here. And that's inside of this little thing here. So I've got to pop the top off, and then I've got to put six drops in the small hole on the top. And then we're going to take this swab, stick it up the nostril, rub it 15 seconds on both sides, twisting and turning it as you do it, on either side, both nostrils, with the same swab. <laughs> All right, so first let's go ahead and get our reagent in there. So what we're going to do is we're going to pop the top off. Keep it pointed up when you do this. All right. And then when you stick it in there, what you've got to do is keep it straight up perpendicular to the to the um, to the uh, floor. So I'm going to turn it over and then I'm going to get exactly six drops. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, shit. Six. Bam, six in there, ready to go. All right, now we've got to open up our um, thing and we're going to have our assistant swab it into her nose. Hang on. You don't want to, whatever you do, don't touch that side of this thing with nothing other but your nose. Here we go. Do you have it right, ready? Go ahead, yeah, go. 15 seconds. Keep going. Keep going. You got 10 more seconds and twist the thing oh, as you do it. Twist it as you do it. Get it in deep. It's three deep. quarters of an inch. Isn't that 15 seconds? No, it's not. It is 15 seconds right now. Now switch nostrils. Get the other nostril. I'll tell you when you're done. Keep going and twist it and turn it all in there. Make sure it's three quarters of an inch up in your nose. It's up in my nose. Deep. 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 Not into the brain. Oh. Keep going. 
Keep going. Keep swirling. It's gotta be done. Not yet. You got another five seconds. Okay, good. Pull her out. Ugh. Don't hit me in the face with that thing. All right, now what you've got to do here is you're going to stick it underneath here like this. Push it under. And then once you get it up here, you're going to rotate it. You see here it shows you to rotate it three times. So we're going to go one, two, three. So it's getting all the juice inside of whatever that is. Right? That's disgusting. And um, let's make sure we got it deep enough and far enough up. All right, it shows only to push it to right about where we've got it. All right, and we rotated it good. Now we're gonna pull the adhesive off of here. There's our blue control. And all we have to do is flip this over. And as soon as we flip it over and push it down, then we got to start our timer and we're going to go 15 minutes. So I set the timer for 15 minutes and 45 seconds. In the directions, it says that you have to go over 15, but not over 30 minutes. So make sure that you're somewhere in between there, but at least 15 minutes before you look to see if uh, you have results. I'm setting my timer up for 15 minutes. All right, I'm going to start it. Bam, done. We gotta let it go for 15 minutes. And then we're gonna take a look. All right, we're coming down to the countdown, 15 seconds left. And we'll be able to look and see if we have the COVID or not. Bam, done. All right, got it. All right, so now we can take our card and um, we can look. And we, all we have to do is look in the window here. And it appears that there is no bar underneath, not even a faint line. And we do have our purple line up top. So if you look here, you see it says if you have two lines, you're positive. And if you have just one line, you're negative. So I do believe that according to this test, Lynette is negative on her COVID. Congratulations. Thank God. Now you got to throw this thing away. <laughs> and once you are done with your test, to dispose of it properly. Right in the garbage can. All right. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos on how to do stuff. Peace out.